Hey guys, this is Mike here from Ball and Bowies, and today I just wanted to show you guys um, another one of my up and coming males in the collection. And this guy right here is a uh, male BCI Colombian Het Albino T minus. Now the mother was a Sun Glow, and uh, my buddy Gary from uh, New York bred this, and I also have this one's brother in the litter. Um, who is truly spectacular. It was the only one that came out like this other than the holdback he got that's something different But the brother to this one is a hypo orange gasm jungle head albino T minus guys And this is just one of the normals that came out and it's truly spectacular guys I mean this normal male was born 420 2017 so he's almost a year old to the day just about and as you see, guys, he is truly, truly spectacular. I mean, the colors on this boa are just something else, guys, especially for just a normal male, guys. So, again, this is a normal BCI Colombian male, Het Albino T minus. Mother was a sun glow. And the father was a hypo jungle orange gasm, I want to say. Um, I have to ask Gary exactly the genetics on the father again. Um, I think that's what the father is, though. But, um, yeah, the the uh, the other one I have, which I'll have to get out for you guys, is a, like I said, hypo jungle, hypo orange gasm jungle, head albino T minus. But this guy was just one of the normals, and I picked him up first. And um, and the rest of his litter went quick. There was, a, there was about, I think, seven or eight or nine hypos. That were head albino T minus, and I think one guy purchased them all. Like my buddy Gary said, but I was lucky enough to get this one. And uh, like I said, Gary sold me one of his holdbacks um, about a month and a half, two months ago, and uh, that's the um, hypo orange gasm jungle head albino T minus. And uh, thank you, Gary, for selling me that. And we'll show you guys him in another video. But this is uh, the brother, guys. Like I said, born 420. What a great date. But born 420, 2017. And he will be breeding this upcoming season. Um, I'll be pairing him this November or December. And he's going to be getting paired to my uh, female Dottie. And, or possibly Helen the Hypo. So, um, yeah, guys. But as you see, he's a, you know, oh, I don't want him to bite. But he's pretty good size. I This guy's eating a small rat every 7 to 10 days. Well, he was eating a mouse like when he was smaller every seven days. Now he's probably on about a small rat every nine to ten days, give or take a day. Um, but yeah, guys, so this guy is just one of my up-and-coming breeders uh, for the 2018-2019 season. And I just want to give you guys a sneak peek at him. And uh, if anyone wanted to see what a beautiful, beautiful, just normal BCI looks like. I know he is het for albino T-, minus, but other than that, guys, this is just one spectacular, common-looking boa, guys. You know, you don't have any crazy colors or anything going on there. Just natural beauty, guys. And it's truly stunning. But this is Mike from Ball and Boas saying peace.